when I think about someone that may be watching this video that isn't in this world, doesn't have an email list, uh, sort of isn't running one of these businesses, one of the things that I love about your story is you've got a great story about how you got started, where you, you built this little tiny baby list and sort of created a relationship. And so talk about sort of how, how this all got started with your list and sort of what, what did that look like in the early days? Yeah, so I had been writing for that product called the Credit Solution Program. So we help people improve their credit score uh, through an ebook. And I wrote, we had like 1.2 million people on this email list. So I wrote all the emails, learned an insane amount. I would split test like four to eight variations of emails on every single email. And so I just learned a ton, dissected it all, created the principles that made money. Um, and I didn't want to create any, any products about how to write emails while I was working there because mm -hmm. I felt like all of the douchebags online had made like one sale right. and like, I have a system for how to make sales. Yeah. And so I wanted to make sure that I had already sold at least a few million dollars worth of products yeah. before I created a product about it. Yep. And so it was actually, as I was leaving there, I wanted to help the new people that were coming in to write, mm -hmm. to write well. So I was like, all right, I'm gonna make this course, which was, became the 80-20 email copy crash course, which is still maybe the most popular product we yeah, have. one of the best Maybe products. the favorite, yeah. which you have your own story about. Yeah. But uh, that was just my sort of love child of all of the stuff I had learned. And so it's this 30 day course. And so I basically, I launched that. I sent an email to Derek Johansson, who has copy hour, which is fantastic. And I said, buy you a drink. So I knew he lived in San Diego. I lived in San Diego at the time. I was probably, I must've been 24, six years ago. And uh, we met up for coffee and I basically told him how he could improve copy out because I was an arrogant asshole. <laughs> and then I said, uh, I've been thinking about creating this like almost email version of it for email copywriting. And so we launched it to his list and I was making 3,500 bucks a month at the time for my job yep. uh, writing emails. And we made 12 grand that week. I remember this, the final Sunday when it was closing, we did like four grand that day or more. Yeah. No, 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 we did over 50%. So it was like $6,000. Wow. So it was the first day I'd ever made $1,000. So I got half of the money. First day I'd ever made $1,000 in a day. And I was at a bar the whole time in San Diego watching football, American football, drinking. Mm -hmm. And I just had, I had to force myself not to look at my phone for 15 minutes because I was getting notifications to my email for the sales. Yeah. So it'd be like $200, $600, $200, $200. I was like, oh my God, I can't believe this is happening. I was like addicted to checking my email that day. Yeah. And so that little group of uh, people that bought that, it ended up being over the course of that year, there were only 200 people on that list, but I made $55,000 from that list, uh, working maybe three hours a week yeah. while I had moved to a, another job, sort of job, yeah. writing copy and doing marketing for this company, Crisis Education. And so yeah. I looked at that and I made 110,000 from the job from you know, 35 hard. hours a week and I made $55,000 from three hours a week. And now I own this list that would continue to grow, which yeah. that same list is what's become almost passive income yep. that at this point does, you know, 150,000 to 200,000 a month. Yep. And it started with this simple product, an email challenge, essentially yep. a product delivered via email. I only made the first five emails of the product. I hadn't even created the product when I sold it. Yeah. It took me 15 minutes to write the sales page. It was on my parents' couch in Palm Springs. Mm -hmm. um, and that list turned into, you know, a seven figure business yeah. over the course of, uh, in between that, I was, it was basically always a side project. Too. Right. And I had fixed water and I sold that and did all that other stuff. Yep. But uh, that one email list has been the most profitable thing I've ever done. Love it.